Welcome to SpriteMancer Introduction Tutorial. SpriteMancer is a powerful design and animation software that includes different tools like a particle editor, dynamic animations, fluid simulation, 3D support, a powerful node graph, and more. In this tutorial, we are going to do a quick overview of SpriteMancer's UI and workflow. The first thing you'll see after opening SpriteMancer is the welcome screen. Let's see the different sections. Here is the recent project section. It will be empty the first time SpriteMancer is open, but it'll show your recently used projects from session to session. Here is the included example project section. These are varied examples about SpriteMancer's features. It can be a great first contact with the software. Don't look at this section. This is something for the future. We can exit the welcome screen going to the main menu, selecting help and welcome screen. You can also open and close the welcome screen with the F1 button. Here is where the magic happens in SpriteMancer. Let's see the different sections. Here is the layer section. All the tools included need a layer to be rendered. You can create new elements by right-clicking here and selecting Create. Here is the Preview section. You can see a live preview of your project while working on it here. The outline shows the project's canvas size. You can move the preview with the right mouse button, center it with middle mouse button, and zoom in and out with the mouse wheel. Here is the Inspector section. This section will change depending on which layer is currently selected. Here, you will be able to tweak all of the element properties. Next is the Node Graph section. We will go into further details in another video, but you can add nodes here to add post-processing to your animation. It is as simple as adding the nodes you want, tweaking its values, and connecting them to the input. Finally, this is the Render section. Here is where you can simulate and render your animation. You can also change some project properties here, like the project scale. And that's all the sections included to date in SpriteMancer. We will go into each one of them with more detail in future videos. Thank you so much for checking out SpriteMancer. Remember that we have a Discord community where you can share your creations, suggestions, and bug reports. See you in the next video. Goodbye.